Since the end of the 1940s, Sevilla Football Club had not added another title to their trophy room, a drought lasting almost 60 years. But all that radically changed in the 2006-07 season. It was then that the Andalusians initiated the most successful decade ever, which has now made them one of the most decorated clubs in La Liga, above all, on the international stage. Nine titles in 10 years, and it all began that season, coinciding with the arrival at the club of our guest today, Freddy Canute, a man who few could have predicted would become the foreign player with the most games played and the most goals scored in the history of the club. And Magrillo's lost his mark where he wants him. Here's Canute. This time it counts. This time Sevilla go in front. Freddy Canute. I'm very proud of this, above all considering the number of world-class players who have played at Sevilla. To be the number one alongside these players is a great honour. Seven seasons in which the striker, born in France but with Malian nationality, played nearly 300 games in the Sevilla shirt, scoring 136 goals. Scoring record that's only beaten by two legendary strikers of the Andalusian club, Juan Arfa and Pato Araujo. With Arfa and Araujo, Sevilla won their one and only Liga title in 1945-46. But together with Canute, the Sanchez Pizjuan was able to enjoy another great striking partnership, the one he formed alongside Luis Fabiano. I think that we complemented each other very well. We each had our own style. I used to combine with the midfield a little more in the link between the midfield and the forwards. He was a pure number nine. He scored a lot of goals and I think at the time he was one of the best in Europe and the world. When he was on form, he was one of the best number nines in the world. We coincided just at the right time. Sevilla had a great squad and that's why we were able to score so many goals. Great success achieved by Freddy Canute was due largely to his technical skills, which made him one of the most difficult strikers to stop in the league. A real headache for defenders, although he enjoyed taking on the best. I loved playing against the best defenders, against Carlos Puyol, Sergio Ramos. I would raise my game. The better the defence, the more motivated I would always be. It was difficult, but that was something that I liked. At the end of the 2011-12 season, after seven fabulous years, as much for the devoted Sevilla supporters as for the player, in which they celebrated seven titles together, Canute made his farewell to the Sanchez Pizjuan in style. Lo que le faltaba al choque, la épica del héroe que se va, el gol 90 de Canute con la camiseta del He marcado, así que ha sido una buena I scored in my final match, so it was a nice way to sign off. I have great memories of that day because all my teammates lifted me high in the air. Even the following year, when I was playing in China, I came back for a testimonial in aid of my foundation, which was another very very special day. I still feel at home in the city. Every time I return, I always get a fantastic reception. So much so that the French Melian keeps up with everything related to Sevilla, despite having left the club five years ago. 
It's very interesting now. I see that they have changed their style a little. It's a little more defensive, which is understandable at the start. It takes time to adapt. But they are working well. With an attacking style, a great tactical organization, a courageous style of play, a lot of goals, I think they are going to continue improving. Apart from his profile as a footballer, Canute is also well known for his charity work. His foundation works to help disadvantaged children in his native country, the Republic of Mali. Now, he represents La Liga as an ambassador. It is a great honor for me. I spent seven fantastic seasons here, and I have some wonderful memories of my time in La Liga. That's why I'm very proud to represent La Liga in a different way now. This time it counts. This time Sevilla go in front. Freddy Canute. This is the story of Freddy Canute, one of the all-time top 100 goal scorers in La Liga and number 29 in the highest scoring foreign player list. A striker who made history as a player and continues to do so today, now as an ambassador for La Liga Santander.